Tomorrow is the last day you can get your vote in and one race on the ballot in San Diego is for County Dist County Supervisor District 3. Joining us is the incumbent County Supervisor Krista Gaspar to discuss her campaign against Tara Lasso Reamers. Good morning, Kristen. How are you today? Good morning, Mr. Rudy. I'm doing well. Ready for tomorrow to come. Well, we are in the final hours and uh, you know how intense it's getting out there. You had an incident that you that certainly is what we're trying to avoid as far as it relates to the civility meter. That's right, look, today is a really important day for all of us, not only elected leaders, but citizens to call for a civil election come tomorrow. Yesterday, I took my 10 year old out with me. I frequently support other candidates running for local office. We were out sign waving for another candidate, not even on behalf of my own campaign. We're verbally accosted by a gentleman who doesn't support me and my candidacy. He came back later on and had taken a giant uh, Gaspar for supervisor sign with a thick wooden stake, broken it up. Uh, rushed down a, a speeding intersection and hurled this sign at a group of sign waivers there. And an unsuspecting 70 year old woman was struck by this. Uh, that piece of wood could have hit her in her temple. She could be dead. These types of incidents are completely unacceptable. The temperature runs hot throughout this country nearing an important election. My message today is really calling for a civil election. People should feel safe supporting or opposing candidates, uh, measures that are out there. But the best way to do that is to get out and vote. So encouraging everyone to sign up on the People's Alliance for Justice webpage. They have a civility pledge. All of us should sign that. We should keep that in mind heading into tomorrow's election. Your race deemed the most important because it will de determine the balance of power in the county board of supervisors. You have the final 90 seconds. Please, your final statement, if you will. Well, look, we have so much economic recovery and recovery in general to do in San Diego County. Right now is all the wrong time for us to turn the Board of Supervisors over to the labor unions. It needs to be protected by servant leadership. This is something that I brought to the table from the beginning. I'm a mom. When I first ran for office, it was important for me to represent the families in our community. I'm a small business owner. Our small businesses are hurting. Our workforce is hurting at this point in time. I look forward to continuing to serve and to fight for you on the Board of Supervisors and really encourage you to get out and vote tomorrow and please support my candidacy in the District 3 race. Well, by all indications, it's going right down to the wire. Sure is. It is. It's going to be a close race, but looking forward to it. I've worked hard. Thank you so much to all of my supporters, KOSI, for really providing a balanced overview in all the local races. But I'm just grateful. That's all I can say is I'm grateful at this point in time for the support, for the prayer groups out there supporting me today. Thank you so very much. I have always felt so honored, privileged. So much of my passion and purpose in life I've discovered through my work on the Board of Supervisors. I love my job. I want to keep my job. All right, Kristen Gaspar, everybody, thank you very much. As a reminder, Kristen Gaspar faces Tara Lawson-Reamer in the race for the County Supervisor District 3.